what's good youtube fam i i am coming back for a long um very overdue eyeshadow tutorial this is the look um the palette i use is the gilded age so i just happened to see this this is one of the um wet n wild I color icon trios that i didn't have and I've had it for a while, y'all. I have now. I haven't done a favorites video because I haven't worn any makeup at all, like in the summertime, unless I was going out. I've just been way too busy, just way too busy. So anyway, I've already got my eye base. I'm using NYX uh, base in natural. And let's get. Let me get my hair behind, out, of, out of the way. So let's get started. All right, I'm going to start with my um, highlight color. I'm just gonna grab. Um, a Sony Kashuk um, crease brush, and I'm going to use that to lightly apply this very top color right there. I'm just kind of dabbing it in because this really, really ultra sh super shimmery. So, um, wonder how you guys' this summer has been, and if you started school, how was that, and whatnot. You did vacations, how was that? I don't really have much vacation um, this summer. I went down south, but outside of that, when I got back, it was back to business, getting stuff ready for clinicals, getting stuff ready for, you know, my kids to go to preschool, um, then daycare. Because clinicals is a uh, super long, like some of my days are like all day clinicals, so it's fun. All right, now that I've got that um, color applied, I'm just going to take my Coastal Sense um, crease brush and I'm going to dip into the black, uh, this dark brown, not a black, but it's a really dark brown and just kind of pop that in my crease. Ooh, and as for all you guys, girls that are boxing fans, who's ordering the fight tonight? Because tonight, today's, what, the 17th? The um, Mayweather Artis, I think. I don't know. Mayweather. I'm a huge Mayweather fan, so I'm definitely going to be watching that fight. Like, that's just a given. Mm, I'm kind of excited because um, his opponent is supposed to be really, really, really good. So, mm, we'll see. We'll see. So I'm just going to keep building up this shadow, make sure it's um, equal to the, um, the other eyes that I've already done. So, yeah, and I've kind of been on a no-buy to it, which I've done really You know what? I, let me tell you why I've done really good on my no-buy as far as makeup goes. Because I had trouble in my car, school, and whatnot. I think if I didn't have, you know, um, extra expenses to come up, I don't know, I maybe I would have bought stuff. I probably would have makeup, makeup wise. I don't know. I really haven't been seeing anything that I'm really interested in. Um, besides, like um, the new was it 15th anniversary palette from Urban Decay, and I haven't gotten it because I just feel like there's no point. Like I, I'm about to start clinicals. It's a wrap for like makeup. Like as early in the morning as I gotta get up, I won't be applying no makeup. So, anyways, um. Got that shadow popped on. Now I'm going to dip into this really light, pretty gold color. It's like a dirty gold. And I'm just going to pop that on my lid. All the way across my lid. i tell you what I have been rocking a lot, though, this summer. If I was wearing makeup, like, in the daytime, and I just want to pop on some makeup, I've been using a lot of cream eyeshadows. And my favorite one, let me show y'all, because this will probably be my only favorite of the summer, is this e.l.f. cream shadow. And it's, like, a dirty bronze color. I use it a lot for a base, but I love this. I'll pop this on, blend it out a little bit with my, um blending brush and some liner and a little bit of, you know, blush and some lip or some bronzer and some, you know, something for my lips and I'm good to go. I'm out the door with more like Michelin tires. So 
that's pretty much been like all I've done for the summer. Just a cream eyeshadow, some liner, mascara, and bronzer or blush and uh, lip gloss. And I'm just going to take um, Sony Cash's blending brush and just kind of blend the lid color with the crease color. Just going to blend it in like such. Um, that's pretty much it. I'm going to take me some liner when I can find it, wherever it went. Okay. And this is a uh, Lori, um, hmm, carbon black liquid, yeah, carbon black um, liquid liner with the felt tip. I'm trying to um, definitely use it up because I don't want to, you know, I don't want to keep it past this uh, expiration date. And I don't want it, the product to go to waste. And I'm not going to do much of a wing. I'm just kind of not do too much of a wing. Oh, if anybody asks, you know, what foundation I'm wearing, I am not rocking any foundation. Nor do I have on any powder. I just didn't have time. I just have taken a break from studying. School has not even started yet, and I've already got homework and like four chapters to read and um, for lecture and about four chapters to read for clinical slash lab. So, yeah, no time for foundation, no time for powder. All right, for the mascara, I'm going to be using Maybelline's Lash Stiletto, um, the black one with the red tip. And I'm just going to pop that on my lashes. And that's that's pretty much it. Um, I do have on a little bit of blush, <clears throat> and that is um, Balani's uh, Minerals and Mai Tai, one of my favorite blushes. I love this blush. Just something, there it is right there on that finger. Really good everyday blush for a lip. I've got um, what is it? Um, Revlon Color Burst and Carnation. Looks like this. It's actually kind of sheer, guys. Um, it's, it's kind of sheer, so it goes on pretty sheer, which is cool because it's kind of bright of a bright color. And I've also got um, NYX's gloss on Mega Mega Shine in beige on top of that, which is one of my favorite, like, you know, I don't know, everyday pink lips. So that's it for the tutorial. That was like the shortest and quickest tutorial that I've done in such a very, very, very long time. Um, but I'll try to do, because like I said, school's going to be starting and it's going to be very hectic and super busy for me. Um, I'll try to do an eyeshadow tutorial um, every week, at least one Saturday, maybe do a couple of them so I can have some to post throughout the week. But um, And a nursing vlog for um, my subscribers that are into, you know, interested in my nursing vlog. Um, I try to do at least once a week so you know how um, nursing clinicals is, you know, how I'm progressing in nursing clinicals. So, as always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Bye, guys.